Ladies and gentlemen, this is the co-main event of the evening. And now, three rounds in the UFC Light Heavyweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a freestyle fighter, only a professional record of 16 wins with five losses. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC light heavyweight champion for us. And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer and a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 24 wins with four losses. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Cura Team of Brazil, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the UFC middleweight champion of the world, Anderson the Spider. Silva! And with the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Kevin Mohal. Anderson, Morris. Okay, you've both been given your rules. You've been here before. So when the bell rings, come out, give us a good clean one, okay? Touch gloves, come out fighting. Anderson Silva. Forrest Griffin sold out here in Philadelphia. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's fight! Now the word is that Forrest is going to open up with a one-two head kick. Let's see if he actually does that. This is what I've been hearing from guys that know him. Yeah. One thing we do know, his leg kicks are lethal. That helped to win him the title against Rampage. The leg kick champion holds the record for the most leg kicks landed in a three-round UFC fight. 38 against Hector Ramirez. He's throwing a lot of feelers out here, Mike. He's looking to gauge Anderson's response, and Anderson is famous for moving around during the first minute or so of the fight, looking for an opening, and then attacking. But he likes to feel his opponent out as well. Likes to gauge the timing. When he explodes, it's violent. Oh, that looked a lot like James Irvin. Caught the leg through the right hand. Yeah, he didn't exactly throw that the fastest in the world. His last fight, at 205 was against the Sandman and it lasted one minute and one second inside leg kick fingers. lands by Forrest Lots of fingers. Silva switching stances around like he often does Again, that, he goes head for that head kick just throwing it out there, though, Joe. Yeah, exactly. He's not, not, not full speed. Forrest really trying to size things up, really leaving that jab out there. Pushing forward is Anderson Silva. Oh, he caught him right hand. He caught Forrest. He caught him and dropped him, Mike. And he hit him again with that right hook. Now let's see if Silva starts to get really aggressive here. Starts to loosen up. Forrest has got to keep his chin down, Mike. He's got to keep his hands up high and his chin down. Forrest looks up at the clock. 240 remains in round one. Uppercut by Silva. Silva looking to get inside. He says, let's go! This is why they said I should fight you. Wow, he's standing right in front of him. Silva, aggressive here in round one. Confident in his striking. Look at the hands low. Yeah, I think Tucks he really under. does. Oh, oh, down goes Griffin. Well, I think he really is trying to send a message Looking here, Mike. to finish the fight. 
Force has got his feet on him, pushes him off. He's rocked him twice here in round one. Griffin has huge heart, though. One forty-five. Look at Silva. I mean, that's just amazing. Oh, he and again. Again. He's out. He's and out. It is all over. Anderson Silva wow. has knocked out Boris Griffin. Wow. Man. Are you kidding me? The spider is back. He was never gone, man. He just <laughs> never fought anybody who took crazy chances until now. You know, that's what happens when a guy like Forrest fights a guy like Anderson. A guy who takes crazy chances against a guy that technically skilled. I mean, Forrest, after he got tagged, looked so tentative and so slow. Yeah, and here we see Look at Anderson this show. shows complete disdain for the striking ability of Forrest. Look at that right hand. Look at that. I mean, that was just like a paw. He just slapped him, and that was it. Look at this. Bang. That's what did it. I mean, that's incredible. I mean, that's a walking away right jab, and not even a very hard one, it looks like. I think Forrest was already badly, badly hurt before that happened. That's one of the reasons why he looked up at the clock, but, I mean, this is one of... I, mean, I love Forrest Griffin, but this is one of the most embarrassing knockouts I think we've ever seen. Well, I think you bring up a great point, though, Joe. He was hurt not once, yes. not twice, and that was basically the third strike. Yeah, he was already out of it, Mike. No question about it. I mean, that was ridiculous. Well, this is what everybody wanted, was to see Anderson Silva back in his old form. So you want to be the next in line for the 185-pound title? Maybe not after watching this tonight. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Kevin Mulhall has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 23 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Anderson, the spider. Three is all it took for Silva to defeat Forrest Griffin. Let the criticism stop immediately.